fundamentals learning about the following points 1 the computer system 2 input output devices and processing cycle the computer is an electronic device that can perform a variety of operations according to a set of instructions called programs. The computer system works on the principle of input, process, output cycle. In this cycle, the computer system receives input in the form of data and instructions. Process the data on the basis of the instructions. Displays the process data, which is now referred to as information, as output. We say the computer is a system because it is a group of integrated parts which work together to give the desired output. The computer system is made up of the following components. Input unit, processing unit, output unit. Input unit. The input unit is formed by the input devices attached to the computer. These input devices take input in different forms from the user and convert it into machine understandable form. Some commonly used input devices are Die keyboard, mouse, joystick, scanner, microphone, and barcode reader. Some of these input devices are discussed below. Keyboard The keyboard is used to type in letters, digits, and special symbols. When a key is pressed, a signal is sent to the CPU, which is decoded to determine which key has been pressed. The keyboards commonly used by us are known as Quattri keyboards and have 104 keys. The keys on a keyboard can be categorized into the following types. Alphabet keys Capital letters A to Z Small letters A to Z Number keys 0 to 9 Special character keys Star Percentage At Hash Function keys F1 F2 Up to F9 Arrow keys Left Right Up Down Special keys like Enter key Caps lock key Shift key etc. Mouse The mouse is a pointing device. We use it to work in a graphic environment like the Windows operating system. The mouse gives input by selecting and moving objects on the computer screen. It executes commands by clicking on icons, options and menus. The movement of the mouse controls the movement of the mouse pointer. A mouse may have two or three buttons. There are different types of mouse like the scroll mouse, optical mouse and cordless mouse. Joystick the joystick is also a pointing device. It has a stick with a trackball placed on the base at the bottom. The joystick is mainly used as an input device for playing computer games. It allows the user a better and faster control than a mouse, which is why it is so popular. Scanner the scanner creates an electronic form of any printed image. It does this by shining a light on the image. Once the image has been scanned and transferred to the computer memory, it can be modified as desired. 
you could use the scanner to store your photograph on the computer or transfer a picture from a book into your presentation. Light Pen A light pen is a pointing device that looks like a pen and is sensitive to light. The light pen gives input by moving directly on the computer screen. When the device is brought in front of the screen, it sends signals to the CPU. The CPU processes these signals and carries out the instructions. Microphone The microphone takes sounds or speech as input and converts it into a form which can be stored in the computer memory. Web Camera A web camera is used to capture still images and videos. These images can be stored in the computer, printed or uploaded on the World Wide Web. The web camera is used for video conferencing where people placed anywhere on the globe can hold a conversation over the internet, seeing and talking to each other as if they were in the same room. Barcode Reader You will find a pattern of printed bars on various products in the market. Even your library books will have a similar pattern on the back cover. This pattern is known as a barcode. To read this code, we need a barcode reader which decodes and transfers it to the computer system where it is processed. Output Unit The output unit is responsible for displaying the output, that is, information which has been obtained after processing the data. The most commonly used output devices are the monitor, printer, speaker, and plotter. Monitor The monitor is known as the visual display unit, that is, VDU. It has a small screen which displays the output. The output displayed by the monitor is known as soft copy. The monitor also displays the software which is loaded in the computer. There are different types of monitors available in the market, such as the cathode ray tube, that is CRT, monitors, liquid crystal display monitors, that is LCT, and plasma monitors. The CRT monitors are heavy and bulky and could be black and white, monochrome or colored. LCD monitors are flat, occupy less space and have much superior quality images. However, they are more expensive. Plasma monitors are mainly used for very large screens. Printer The printer is used to give output in the printed form. The printed output is called hard copy. A printer can print in black and white or color, depending on the features available on it. Printers can be categorized as impact and non-impact printers. Impact printers Impact printers are also known as character printers. In impact printers, the printer head strikes the printer ribbon to create a mark on the paper just like a typewriter. Impact printers are mainly used to print on continuous sheets of paper. They are slow, noisy and inexpensive and the quality of print is poor. Examples of impact printers are the dot matrix and daisy wheel printers. Non-impact printers Non-impact printers are also known as line printers. In these printers, there is no contact between the printer head and the paper. The printer heads have tiny nozzles which spray ink at great speed on sheets of paper. 
Printing here is done line by line. These printers are faster, noiseless and the quality of printing is much superior. However, they are much more expensive. Examples of non-impact printers include inkjet and laser printers. Inkjet printers are economical and commonly used. Laser printers are faster and produce high quality prints. They are also much more expensive than inkjet printers. Impact printers are character printers. They are slow, noisy, inexpensive. Quality of print is not very good. And the examples of impact printers are dot matrix, daisy wheel. Now we'll see non-impact printers. They are line printers, fast, noiseless, expensive, high quality prints and the examples of non-impact printers are inject and laser. The quality of an inkjet or laser printer depends on how many dots per inch that is DPI are used to print the image. The higher the DPI, the better the quality of printing. Inkjet printers have a DPI in the range of 300 to 720, while laser printers are in the range of 300 to 1200 DPI. Plotters Plotters are used in places where images like graphs, charts, maps, etc. are required to be printed. Plotters have a pen fitted on a movable arm. They are mainly used by engineers, architects and seismologists. Speakers Speakers are used to output sounds, voice and music from the computer system. The quality of music played on the computer is very good since it is a digital sound. Summary In this chapter, we have learned following points. The computer system works on the principle of input, process, output cycle. Input devices take input in different forms from the user and convert it into machine understandable form. Some commonly used input devices are the keyboard, mouse, joystick, scanner, light pen, etc. Output devices are responsible for displaying the output. Some common output devices are the monitor, printer, etc.